God, I feel really self-conscious. <laughs> We're here in Dunleary's Pavilion Theatre to check out David O'Doherty making his triumphant hometown return after winning the prestigious If Comedy Awards in the Edinburgh Comedy Festival there a couple of weeks ago. It's formerly known as the Perrier, but they don't sponsor it anymore, so they're not allowed to say that. Um, so we're just going to try and talk to some people. Maybe that person? No, no, she's walking away. Um, <laughs> do you guys know um, David O'Doherty, the comedian, playing in here tonight? He's his yeah, he's an absolute hero. Really? Yeah? yeah. You've got tickets? No, unfortunately, I have other plans. Oh, okay. So you're big fans of David. Have you seen him before? Uh, no. No, really? <laughs> oh, you nice. seen him on telly? You My mom saw him three days ago. Your mom saw him. What did your mom think? Always deadly. So, what's your impression of David so far, anyway? Probably the stuff that you've seen. Oh, so, so funny. funny. Yeah, funny. yeah. This is my mom. Oh, really? Is this the whole thing? Family yeah. gathering going on? I'm just a boyfriend. I'm kind of an outsider. Well, I'll get in there. Come on. Everyone's together. That's true. He's kind of like Dimitri Martin. But he's that's, that's true. He toured it to meet Dimitri Martin yeah, in the States. No, yeah. Right, we're done. Show's over. Show's over. We didn't get any footage of the actual show itself because apparently that's frowned upon. Um, but let's go and talk to some people and see what we can come up with. Oh Good my thing. god, it's a camera. Uh, so what do you think of the show? It was great. It was yeah. really fun, yeah. But it was totally cracking. Yeah? Yeah. yeah it's good. The second half was really good. And what about yourself? I assume you were in there as well? Yeah, yeah, it was pretty good. I was very impressed. Yeah, yeah cool. Uh, David O'Darley, the man of the hour himself, who we weren't allowed to shoot inside there for obvious reasons. No, really? Yeah. Well, well we didn't ask for anything. Pretty it's dangerous. common sense. It's triple X. That's right. <laughs> mm -hmm. It was, it was. It's too hot for the internet. So, let's see, I didn't think this through at all, but how did, did you enjoy the show in there? Nice yeah, it was a receptive audience, wasn't it? Was, it? it was, yeah, it was really nice fun. I, I probably um, I have a tendency to just go on and on a lot. Mm. Uh, but, uh, so I did that a little bit, but <laughs> I kind of, I just like waffling. I've just on the Edinburgh Festival we have to do a super tight like 60 minutes Yeah. but so I used to do about an 80 minute show in that 60 minutes so tonight I think I did about a two and a quarter hour version of that 60 minutes <laughs> so, uh, so you could have got like the B-side and everything it's yeah, yeah yeah did, and the director's comment <laughs> yeah you got it love it, love it. Yeah, yeah. and uh, so you obviously come back off the Edinburgh Festival with the uh, yeah, yeah. Big win there How, has anything changed since then have like, you, have you um, noticed like bigger audiences because yeah. you mentioned during the show that this is the first time you played here when it's been full yeah yeah uh, people are more responsive to my ludicrous ideas for, for uh, uh, TV and film and things uh, like really? that yeah, yeah yeah so I'm trying to make a really expensive TV show at the moment with oh, yeah. like a lot of CGI and stuff like that in it. Just for absolutely no reason whatsoever. Uh, they? Well, because they, they're kind of CGI listening you can. a bit. I am. Um, I want to. Uh, um, uh, I've been offered some incredibly bad TV shows. That's right. a revelation. I was offered one which was the pitch for it was it's like The Apprentice but with pets. <laughs> and uh, the pet apprentice. I don't even know where to begin with that. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. incredible. Yeah, yeah. Wow, that's well, that could, that, that's got potential, I think, doesn't it? You're fired. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of the show? Oh, I thought it was uh, great. Great. Yeah, very good. Yeah. Any other superlatives to uh, add to it? Great. Uh, you, you can go great, both. Great's very also, middle of the road, you know, there's kind also of... Also not that good as well. It was very good. Very good? Yeah, I'm not as... Yeah. What was it about that you didn't like? I was only messing. I, I like... <laughs> it was uh, inspirational. Yeah, yeah. Inspirational. Yeah. That's high praise. What about this guy? Unforgettable. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, if I was to ask you a question that would be really, you know, profound, what would it be? Oh, um... I find it interesting and entertaining for someone who hasn't really thought this out. You go, uh, you go, David, what you do is just, t like, dribbling on about your own life. Like, how do you possibly, like, do you consider this to be a legitimate job for a grown-up? <laughs> so something like that would probably be a good one. And then I'd punch you in the face. And, um, and then I go profound this, and then I take off your glasses. And, <laughs> and then you start us at the bathroom, realize there's no other way. Yeah, and we get what? you sheepishly walking out. Oh, no, damn! <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it. Cool. Yeah, I'll wrap it up. Thanks yeah. for your time. Thanks for that's that's fantastic. Thanks for coming. Oh, well, well, no problem. The show. I certainly yeah. didn't. Yeah. 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 So there we go. This was David O'Darley at the Pavilion Theatre in Dunleary. It's late now. Well, it's half ten. It's not really that late. I'm just saying that. Um, but yeah, we're done now, and we interview people. We got David O'Darley, which is a nice thrill as well. Um, so yeah, hope you enjoyed it.